So right now my home needs to be in silence as uh, I'm doing a recording for a video. I'm out and about. I'm here in front of Berlin Sprig and I thought of something to tell you guys. Oftentimes when we think of repentance, we think of turning away from a thing. Well, think about that. If we turn away from a thing, that leads us to a thousand things to turn towards. And some of them way worse than the thing that we're turning away from. Yeah, there's a little bit of uh, turning away in the subject of repentance, but when you teshuva, when you turn, think more about what you're turning towards. And if you keep that focus on what you're turning towards, then you'll be so much better off. I used to be horribly addicted to all kinds of drugs for a long time, and there was pretty much no saving me from that. But uh, when push came to shove and I knew that I needed to make a change, I had the foundation of the Lord within me from where I was raised. And I knew that I needed to turn to God. And I didn't think to myself, hey, I'm going to quit doing drugs. Now that I look back at that, I, I said, you know what, I need to turn to God. I need to give my life to the Father. And that's what I did. And being saved from drug use and alcoholism, as awesome as it is and was, it was really kind of a, an aside, like a cherry on top of a very, very large cake. And he did completely save me from those things. I was a raging alcoholic. And um, all those things that they say about alcoholics always being in recovery, that's, that's not me. I often have a beer from time to time and have absolutely no desire to have more drugs. I still go to concerts and hang out with people who do drugs on a regular basis, and not just pot. And the desire is just not there. And I'm telling you guys, it's not because I turned away from my sin, it's because I turned to God. And it was His strength, His love, His authority that took care of all that other stuff. Hallelujah. Be strengthened in God. Amen.